Hey, I'm Crystal. And I'm Aaron. I'm Siobhan Magnus. Casey James. I'm Lee. I'm Katie. I'm Tim. I'm Dee Dee Benami. I'm Andrew. And I'm Big Mike. And you're, you're watching, watching. And you're watching. And you're watching, watching. And and you're watching, watching Billboard.com. Billboard. the best. <laughs> excited about going on tour. I'm feeling good. Um, I'm really excited to meet all the fans. I think that it's it's going to be a great show and we're all so diverse in the kind of music that we want to record and who we want to be as artists. We get to choose the songs that we do. Um, they're whole songs. It's not a minute 30 each song. It's the entire song. I love that. I don't think we really understand what's really going to happen, how big it's going to be. I believe we're going to see close to half a million people before it's all said and done. Really excited about like the behind the scenes stuff like riding on the bus and like you know playing fun road games when everything's ready and your songs are ready and your outfits ready I'm really excited about my outfit <laughs> a big part of the tour I'm looking forward to is is being able to see all the fans you know that support it and then on the off days go record my album I love to inspire people and I want to move people and that's what I'm about is emotionally connecting to a song. I want to lock in my fan base is what I want to do. I'm looking forward to like raising my own game to a new level, being in arenas. I think like the biggest crowd I performed in front of was like 300 people maybe in my school talent show. Thinking about the person who walked in that door to audition for, for Simon and Randy, I'm a very, very different person. I mean, I've, we've had to mature so much because of the show. We've had to grow. We've had to get out of our comfort zones. I learned to walk in heels. I <laughs> learned to do my own hair and makeup. And, uh, you know, those, those are very important life skills. Harry Connick Jr. is hands down my favorite mentor of, of the uh, mentors. <laughs> Try to keep it on me. I'm the mentor. So you have to get off that note quicker. Okay. Uh, which note? Or when you go, uh, okay, we'll work on colors and shapes next. What do you mean, which note? He, he really just puts so much effort and work into, you know, working with each and every one of us. He would just talk to us like people and, you know, not taking away from anybody that came to the show and did, you know, was a mentor because they were all amazing in their own rights. But he had the time, and he took the time, and it meant a lot to us. I left just before Harry Connick Jr. was there. I texted Lee, and I said, please tell Harry Connick Jr. I said hi, and that I love him. I get this message, hey, Siobhan, it's Harry Connick Jr. here. Where are you? You're supposed to be here. Oh, yeah, you got voted off. Well, I was really looking forward to meeting you, and I think you did a good job. And, I don't know, it was just so cool. You know, it's been like a big thing after Idol. Everyone's talking about, you know, this person, what they've done versus what this person's done. It's like, we're all different artists. You know, I respect everybody that's done this, you know, to the fullest. But at the same time, you know, we're all different artists. And there's a little pressure, you know, because you're the winner. You gotta, you gotta be excellent, you know. But uh, at the same time, the show is over. So it's t time for me to do what I want to do and, and be myself. I think most of us, we've got our fingers crossed for record deals. That would be ideal. <laughs> a deal. And <laughs> that was a really bad one. It was never really a competition for us. No. We just all got along. We all wanted each other to do good and uh, do our best. And we did, and we're all here now.